Hey everybody, welcome back to Sylvia's Sweet Sweet Reactions. And today, they finally, Netflix, love you, finally released the official season three trailer. Because I was not going to do a reaction to the teaser. I need a full trailer. And I was not doing a reaction unless it was a full trailer. And here we are with Bridgerton season three official trailer from Netflix. Long awaited trailer. First and foremost, my novels, Legacy Born and Legacy Born Demons Rising, are available on anywhere where you buy books Amazon, Barnes and Noble, Bookbubs. Check it out. Let me know what you think of it. Let's get started. Dearest gentle reader, we have been apart for far too long. Damn, she's beautiful. She is At the last, so beautiful. London's fashionable set has made its return. And it seems that our bon ton is moving with the changing tide. So, too, is this author. I cannot live at home any longer. I must take a husband. Does my lady have a suitor in mind? Is that our brother? Colin. Brother, under what foreign sun did you apparently get so sturdy? <laughs> oh, that is good to see you. Is it? Something wrong. Seems as though every Bridgerton was born to attract notice. For some of us, the notice is very slight. If our husband is what you seek, let me help you. Are we not friends? Friends. I should like to see your skills as they are first. How delightful to see you all. The splendid weather we are having. Oh, shit. I would not be angry if I'm to be a lost cobbles. You must not say such things. You are Penelope Featherington. Do not forget that. She's not seeking a husband in you, I hope. No, I'm only helping her find one. Since when are you worried about Penelope? What this author knows to be true is that diamonds are not the only gems that sparkle. Debling. He is eager to take a wife this season. You look especially beautiful tonight, Miss Featherington. You have done very well, Penelope. What more could you want? Mother, do you believe the best foundation for love is friendship? It is rare, but you must follow your heart. What is the primary force that guides us along our paths? Penelope. Is it our minds or our hearts? Damn it anymore! <laughs> oh! Dang! <laughs> oh, you guys. That, that, what is it? The, um, that, like, her walk, them walking to each other and then them just, like, heavy breathing, like, ah, <sighs> uh, I can't. I can't take it! I can't take it! Oh my God. Oh. <laughs> uh, okay, so I don't know about you guys, but I did buy my Bridgerton box. Um, it has the like the dress, the shirt, the wine, well, sparkling ap apple cider, popcorn and all that. I'm still waiting on it. I pray that it comes by May 16th <laughs> so I can watch it and wear my Bridgerton outfits while I binge watch the first part of season three. Oh my goodness. I am so enthralled. Like we have so much to like look for word to. Oh my goodness. I can't talk. <laughs> like I love the fact that we are going to be able to see um, the next Bridgerton sister um, basically be um, co like her coming out. We're going to be seeing that. And then we're going to see um, um, Ant Anthony and um, his wife. I forgot her name. 
I can't believe I forgot her name. But his wife, we're going to be able to see them, like, being husband and wife because we were robbed, unfortunately, of that, of really seeing um, Daphne and Simon be actually, like, a married couple after they became parents. So, like, we were robbed, but we kind of weren't robbed about that. But I would have loved to see Daphne and Simon, I think we all did at heart, wanted to see them as parents, like him coming to family functions and them being parents. Um, you know, basically the bliss of after marriage, like after just getting married type situation. Um, but we was robbed of that, but it's good that we want to be able to see that with Anthony and his wife. And then I do feel bad for Penelope a little bit because the whole situation with her and her, um, her best friend, um, Eloise, um, their friendship is rocky, but she's kind of like, I do miss my friend, but like, forget her right now. I am tired of living in this house with my sisters and their husbands. I need to get out of this house. I need to take a husband so I can move out. I love that. And I love that there is a rivalry um, of the guy that they sat there in. Um, apparently he's a new character. He's not originally in the books. That's what I've been told by someone I know that reads Bridgerton. Um, <laughs> she, she's reading them not in order, not in order at all. Um, she's re honestly reading them <laughs> as the seasons come out. So she read the first one and then she read about Anthony and then now she skits um, the second oldest brother story because that story is kind of like a Cinderella story because the girl is like poor and all that stuff like that, whatever. That's what she told me. And then um, she skipped to when um, Colin and Pen the book where Colin and Penelope get together. She read that. She's like reading that book. So she told me that this character, she had, she don't know this character in the story. Like she has not seen him at all. So this is really interesting how they, you know, change it up a bit. Um, like, you know, it's, it's great. It's great. It's great. So I hope you guys enjoy my reaction and I hope you guys can't wait as much as I can to watch Bridgerton season three. See you later, you guys. Bye.